everybody, welcome back to Shadow of the Erd Tree. Last time we defeated the dread dragon known as Bale uh, with some help, which I am not at all upset about. Because the guy we got help from was a NPC summon called Egon, and he was amazing. Bale was cursed several times. Ow. Hello on garbage. Um, and that was cool. We went up to the peak. We went up to the peak of the peak. And now we are trying to kill this deathlight bird. Uh, thrashed me rather soundly at the end of the last stream and I can't see what the hell's happening. I'm gonna die very very quickly. Very quickly indeed. You know what? Let's get, let's get Torrent out here. He did not listen to me. Torrent literally ignored me. You. I always need a little bit of um, wiggle room after starting playing Elden Ring for the day, you know? Like, you can't just settle right back into it. Really drank from the wrong flask, cost Torrent his life. I'm a bad pet owner. I'm a bad human, because I died. I hate these birds. They suck. I don't even know what I'm doing in this area as well. I'm just looking, I guess I'm looking for Charo's hidden grave. Let's say I'm looking for that grave. The annoying thing is that these little birds, like it wouldn't be that bad if you just rode straight to the uh, to the big one, but you have to deal with these annoying little troublemakers. So I can pretty reliably kill three of them. Oh now. Oh my god, where did that even come from? Long time to I'm starting to think lock on is and I'm dead. I'm starting to think lock on is more of a hindrance than it is a help in almost every single case. You know? When all the bosses do is Exactly like that. How funny would it be if this was the whole two hours stream? I want more Skadu Tree blessings. I thought they'd be more prevalent. I haven't been spoiled on anything in this DLC so far, but I did read someone say that there were quite a lot of Skadu Tree blessings out there in the world. So why haven't I found that many? <laughs> Very upsetting. I guess Torrent's not really that much help in this fight anyway. Panic roll all day. All of his actions are so delayed. And I know that's hardly a, a unique thing with Elden Ring bosses. They all have ridiculously delayed actions, which makes them so much harder to dodge. <laughs> that one was my fault, though.
Where do those come from? I don't even see them launch them. They just hit me from the back every single time. I think these might be my least favourite enemy in the whole game, you know. And that's including, uh, whatever you call those tree, those giant tree worm things in the base game. That do nothing but flail around, but at least they're, they're so big that you can kind of get away with sticking close to them and they won't really hit you because they're just... To uh, un... what's the word I'm looking for? I don't know. They're big. They're really big. This bird is not big. This is a very small bird by comparison. This is terrible. That was absolutely terrible. Leave me alone. <laughs> I just want to find Charon's grave or something. Stagger in there. This is what we need. Flame. Everywhere. It's really hard not to sound like a whiny bitch when you're playing Elden Ring. Honestly. Don't make this be a comeback to it, boss, as well. We're going to have to come back to that dragon as well. I hate leaving things unfinished. I'm a finisher. I'm not a lever.
Mm. Where did that other bird go? I was trying to wait until he killed it, but it just kind of vanished. Maybe he already did. I cannot dodge that fucking grab. And I'm dead. I'm dead. It's okay. It's okay. I just beat Bale the Dread Dragon or whatever. It's fine. You know? Now I can't beat a bird. It's normal. I just need, I, I say it every stream, I need more blessings. I got killed and smashed. Just go and find more blessings, Joe. Just leave this bird and go and find more blessings. You'll be much happier. Pointless heal. So pointless heal. What is even happening? games work. This entire world that you live in was literally built specifically for me. in the fire. Oopsie daisy. I didn't sprint. I thought I was sprinting, but I wasn't. This is fun. This is fun to watch, isn't it? Just the same five seconds of gameplay over and over again. playing an MMO. Okay, come on. Come on, baby. again. Okay, 
The game makes it quite confusing by giving you two gold-coloured flasks. I'm just saying. This is a problem that everyone has, but nobody will admit but me. If I say what needs to be said. I think it would be really funny if uh, this game was like Devil May Cry in that, you know, if you if you die enough times it offers you an easy mode. Are you serious? Where are you going? I'm back here. Um, but for Elden Ring it would be like after 1,000 deaths or something, you know? Like a ridiculously high number of deaths and it would be like sure you want to keep playing on this difficulty? Are you really sure? But of course one of the wonders of Elden Ring is that you have dynamic difficulty because you can make it easier for yourself by summoning help whenever you need it. Honestly, I'm, I'm navigating this more by, like, extrasensory perception than anything else. having wings but no feathers. Cringe. Please don't get frostbite. Oh, 
Oh, thank God. <gasps> Fuck that bird. Fuck that bird. I know I said I was going to try and curse less on stream, but fuck that bird. No law. No law drops. Just a big, stupid bird. I'm glad I investigated this place. That's what I'm saying. Can I please get some Skadoo Tree Blessings? Please. See more danger worms over there. Almost ran straight off a cliff. The only one who went off a cliff by the look of things. Got a big plant over here. Guarding. Something stupid that I don't need. Towards that big dead dragon. Oh my god, what is that? Dry horse. I have one healing thingy left. I keep wanting to say Estus from Dark Souls. It's not Estus, it's something else. That operates in exactly the same way. But this fucking thing drops a Skadu Tree blessing. Oh goody, it's another one of those. Remember him? Remember him? Wasn't that fun fighting that guy? Remember how I said it's hard not to come off sounding like a whiny bitch playing this game? Fire guy. I shouldn't even be getting close to him. This looks promising. Skadoo tree blessing. My God. Scared me. Look at him go. Look at him go. Are those actually coming over here? They are. What is the range on this thing? That is nuts. At it, he just hates me. Stop, dude. They're dropping too far a distance. Torrent has uh, surprisingly weak ankles. He does! Look, look at this! He's miles away! Please, I just want a Skadu Tree Blessing. Why isn't none of this random stuff the thing I want? Fire guy! <laughs> Ooh, that was close.
Alright, here's what we're going to do. Uh, something I can't do because it won't let me. Can't open the map. Can't rest when enemies are nearby. So I'm guessing these worms aren't... Oh god, that was a big drop. No, we're fine. Oh, it's another jail? Interesting. Let's go in here. At least there'll probably be a uh, grace in here. Yeah. The Mentor's Jail. left. First off right. Necessary item ahead. How I wish that were true. Oh, it, yeah, okay. I'll accept key. Wary of right. Uh, ah. You never have too many frozen maggots, that's what I always say. these things. I guess we can just expect the jails to be full of um, the unfortunate specimens of the, of the jar project. Please, I can't stand the sound! I need no salvation. Please stop, desist, you wretched lamentation. Oh. I wasn't expecting another prattling pate. Voice resounds seeping into the brain, weeping, 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 ever weeping. Prattling pates? In case you are unaware. Do this. This one's for on garbage. You're beautiful. So I wonder if this one has some special properties. It's a different colour. Okay. <laughs> I guess that might be useful somewhere. Thanks. God. How many look how many heads?
these things are horrible. Come up and get you. I'm gonna have to go up and get him. That scream really hurts. I don't know if it's going to be in this jail, but there's got to be a place to use that uh, lamentation we got, I reckon. I love her. Ha 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 ha. Hey guys, aren't you glad you can totally see my face in the webcam right now? <laughs> Give up too late. <laughs> the dead have been long left to wonder what they need is leadership. <laughs> oh my god, there actually was a hidden path. That never happens. And it's locked. <laughs> I don't think there's any point in me honestly having a webcam when the conditions are like this. To be fair, my bedroom light is not on. But that's, uh, like, it illuminates behind me, so not a lot of use. You know what? I am actually going to turn it off. There's there's no point in me having it. Plus, everyone can see my giant forehead, so. Where did I go? One thing I've always really appreciated about the Souls games and uh, their ilk is uh, how real- I don't want to say realistic it is, like when you're- like for instance there, my sword goes through the wall, but here it bounces off. I really like when it bounces off. I like- when it actually takes into account stuff like that. So I don't have the key needed. How do I get through here? Into the darkness. Giant rats. Giant, giant rats. Uh, these ones are like diseased 
and they desperately need putting out of their misery. I'm very sorry. Inner meat. Hmm. Clarifying Horn Charm plus two. Vastly raises focus. Horns are sublime artifacts to horn scent, and their presence confirms the belief that they are a chosen people. And the repeated sprouting of fresh horns can create a tangled horn, which is viewed as an irrefutable symbol of primacy. Punch the air for no reason. Right, so what the hell? I'm missing something. Across here, seems. Oh, cat noises. I'm missing. <coughs> Pardon me. <laughs> We've been this way? No, we haven't. Oh, look at them. Cute they are. I have to kill them. They're so cute. that violent explosion again. I think I might have accidentally turned up the... Uh... Yeah, I did. There's buttons on the back of this controller that... Uh, controller that control how hard you have to push down the shoulder buttons. Key! We got the key. Unfortunately, I do have to see. See, I'm going to kiss these guys. <laughs> Excuse me, buddies. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm not killing these guys. I love them. You know, knowing what terrible horrors go into making one of these just makes me love them even more.
Excuse me. Okay, now we're onto something. Now we're cooking with gas. Boss room. Try calmness. Lamenta. Invisible? Maybe not. Something tells me this might be the place to use the uh, Lamenta thing. happening to me. <laughs> I don't like the look of this. What happens when I get too many of those? Oh. I just lament. Oh wow, that just ki that kills you. That's interesting. Try calmness. How is calmness supposed to... Is that a joke? I can never tell with these messages. Try calmness. Try taking on all at once. I've got two of them on me. How do I stop that? <laughs> I don't understand. Oh, 
Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh! Is that how many of them are left? I think that's how many of them are left. Like, I have to kill them all, otherwise... Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I think I figured it out. Pepper's just lying on the floor like she's so hot. That's one. Yeah, okay. Okay, this is good. Yeah. We, we figured out. This is fine. actually die, that would be unfortunate. Nope, hopefully just having two on me won't be a big deal. Probably gonna summon another bunch, yeah. I'll have to do it one more time. Should be okay. Lamented idiot. It's a fun little puzzle boss. Lamenter's mask. Stone mask twisted into an expression of rapturous grief. Use while disrobed to transform into a lamenter. This change cannot be undone except by death. Using this mask while already transformed causes the head to swell in size. This transformation tallies with the state of a denizen of paradise, but the people of the tower denied and hid it from the world. In their foolishness, they viewed the true bliss with deep fear? What? <laughs> What's the point of it, then? I don't get it. It's like the dragon priestess heart, but turns you into a dip gives you depression. What a weird boss. What a weird item. I really would like to find some scattered tree blessings. I'm not going to stop talking about this. I need power up. I need strength. Oh, we're like right by where we started the DLC, just down below. Interesting. Gonna 
get rid of that one. This it's deceiving me. Oh yeah, this guy. Whoa! Sorry, Torrent. Oh my god. Ugly Hippo dead. But he dropped a Scadu Tree Fragment. That is wonderful, wonderful news. Oh goodness me. Right, we want to get down to this blue area, I think. We can power up. We can power up. I think we can power up. This is great. Yes. Still only need two. We're harder, better, faster, stronger. Oh, I don't think I actually went up here. Let's do this first. Big bird. Not big bird. I mean, that bird is big. Unusually large bird. Is that just a statue? Please just be a statue. Doesn't look like a statue. It's a statue. See you later, idiots. Down required. I shouldn't have called them idiots. Okay. Yeah. We're done here. There's an episode of Invader Zim. I can't remember which one it is. Uh, but where a character goes like, leave me alone, I just want to eat crops. And whenever I say leave me alone, I want to say I just want to eat crops afterwards. He 
It's like a monster or something. I don't know. Cerulean Coast. I believe this is where we got the map. Over in that direction. So we'll go this way. That was a bad noise. Let's not fight this thing right now because I don't know where the nearest grace is. Let's do that first. There we go. You thought we'd go today without a dragon fight. No, no. Let's use some uh, ruins. constantly running to get the ones I dropped. Ghost Flame Dragon Fight. Let's go, boy. Hopefully this fight doesn't drag on. being able to see shit. Good. Ba boom. attacking me. Oh, these guys. Did he summon these? It's not good. accidentally killed the turtle.
No, he's still he's alive. He's fine. <laughs> oh god, there's so many enemies. Man, these enemies are so annoying. They won't let me do my thing. I just want to do my thing. Got him, baby. That's the way it's done. For you. I've had enough of your disingenuous assertions. Nothing fancy going on here. pretty area. Fire guy. Where does this go? Oh, this might be a. Fu We're gonna have to fight this one, I think. Okay, we're a dab hand at this now. Dab hand. What does dab hand even mean? It's fine. Don't even worry about it. Okay, we gotta bait this move then, I guess. Then we're getting close.
We're professional giant wicker man killers at this point. Down he goes. Nope. Gonna fall down. Thank you. Just fifty one thousand damage, not a big deal. Viridian Hidden Tear. Interesting. Eliminates all stamina consumption. Ooh, interesting. Can be mixed in the flask of wondrous physics. The resulting connection eliminates all stamina consumption. Uh, only brief though, so I'll probably keep the one I have, which I think just gives me a passive buff to stamina regeneration, which is probably much better than just infinite stamina for a short amount of time. Raise the gorgeous view. Four big dogs. Oh yeah, they can do that by the way. Rolly boys. Get up, uh, get on up. We're not back on Gravesite Plain. We're underneath Gravesite Plain. Climb back up there? Or is there a secret hidden behind the waterfall? No. There's never a secret hidden behind the waterfall. We need more waterfall secrets. Whoops. See Daisy. The 
this doesn't feel like the right way to go. <laughs> I guess we're, uh, yeah, we're back on Gravesite Plane. I was once told a coffin could convey its passenger upon a gentle cruise to the velvet garden of deepest purple. Oh, to slumber in such a paradise. In the base game, you could get in a coffin and it would go up a waterfall somehow. That it? It's very pretty water in this game, yes. I don't think I can make it. I'm thinking I'm supposed to come at this area from the other way around. Like I'm supposed to come down these waterfalls. Quite thirsty, actually, now that I think about it. Time for gorgeous view. How is that? That bow I got from my friend Egon. There it is. That's got to be something good. That's got to be. That's got to be a scatter tree blessing. Come on, come on. That's got to be. <laughs> Never mind. Mushroom, mushroom. Bell bearings are items you can give to um, an NPC back in the round table hold and it in like increases their shop. I'm guessing a mushroom seller's bell bearing will allow us to buy mushrooms. Crab. Unnecessary here. Crab eggs, disgusting. I fucking hate crabs. Like, in real life. I think we should just leave them alone. You know, leave them in the sea. They can have the sea, that's fine. I don't need to go there. I don't need anything from the sea. Let the crabs have it. We'll have the land, everyone will be happy. I definitely think I was supposed to come in this way. See, I, d I, I get it. I get the cuteness factor. But, no.
You know, I saw a video of one, like, crawling out of, you know, like, a, a plastic shopping wrapper, you know, like it had just been put in there alive and it was crawling out on its own in the shop, on the shelf. And I was just like, oh, just leave it in the sea. Leave it in the sea. I don't want to eat them. I don't want to touch them. Alright, what do we got? Ooh! Mikella's been here. Mikella. Mikella. I don't know how to pronounce it, really. And maybe one of the peeps are here? Nope. But that means there's probably a scattered tree fragment. I abandon here my doubt and vacillation. Why is Mikola just casting off pieces of themselves? To what end? Still need another fragment, unfortunately. I thought maybe we had two now. For some reason. Worms. Wormies. Some nice, some not nice. But all wormies. No thanks. Imagine how hard it must be to drink from a galloping horse. Imagine how much of it would get in your eyes, you know? Good old fashioned giant. It's gonna throw pots at me. Ooh, sleeping pots as well. That's interesting. Can't get at this weak spot, that's annoying. Never mind. Didn't need it. Sleep of a giant. Mikola has an alter ego. People assume Saint Trina who is associated with sleep. Putting that out there. Get the feeling there's a boss coming up. Is all very wide open plain is usually a bad sign. Goo. Strong goo. That's like an Italian recipe. I'll have the strong goo, please. The strong gooly. St. Trina Disciples Cookbook. Why is it always item crafting? I know. 
A record of crafting techniques left by a disciple who pursued the teachings of the Saint of Sleep, yet what seemed a gentle sleep at first ripened into velvet. I bet these items are super useful. I will never ever use them. A lot of goo around here. Is this it? Nothing else at the southernmost part of the map? of maybe go down into that hole, but I don't think we can. Oh no, maybe we can. Why is it always down? Here we go. Goo. Me alone, goo. Grace down there. Down we go. Oh, there's definitely a boss. We like bosses, maybe? I guess it depends on the boss. I mean, why else am I playing this game if I don't like fighting bosses, let's be honest. Oh, this might be locked, actually. There's a thing there. That usually means we can't go. Sealed and obscured by Mikola. So I think we're going to have to come back here much later. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, well, I am sure there are more secrets to be found. And of course, there's that one dragon we still haven't fought. But I think we're going to have to move on. Real quick, I want to see if I can get to this weird fingery area. Looks like it might be inaccessible, but oh, I need to actually put a marker here so I remember what's going on. Kid named area. <laughs> I'm gonna put a boss note here. It's probably not a boss. It could be, but that'll just remind me to check it out. I thought maybe this was a path, but I guess not. Like before, just gonna casually sidle around these dragons. Excuse me. That one might be dead, actually. <laughs> I don't think I can access that. Oh, I 
fuck's going on down there? I don't know. Well, let's go. This way. It's really just no pepper. It's hot, isn't it? You just I've stretched out. Skadoo at Altus. That's Lena, I believe. Hello again. Did you meet my compatriots? They're quite the congregation. From places as far and wide as you can imagine. Doubtless it have all come to blows at first glance. Were it not for the charm kindly Mikula put upon us. This is what allows us to serve together. The work of a living god. Ask about the horn scent. Wondering about the horn scent, are you? True enough? In any other circumstance, he'd be at our throats. Long ago... Queen Marika commanded Sir Mesmer to purge the tower folk, a cleansing by fire. It's no wonder the horn scent holds the earth tree in contempt. That aside, man is by nature a creature of conquest, and in this regard, the tower folk are no different. They were never saints. They just happen to be on the losing side of a war, but it's still a wretched shame. Hmm. The charm that Mikula placed upon them. The thing about Mikula is they, they can compel affection, according to some of the item descriptions related to them. So it's like, it's very curious as to whether they're at, like, what are their motives? They can compel affection. That doesn't sound good. Pepper really wants to leave the room, I think, so I have to be right back again. Cat duties. Hot. Oh no, we don't want to go yet. We want to talk to people. And we want to pick this up. Oh yes, we do. I abandon here my heart. Like, what is, what is he doing? Good news, we can power up. Do we need three now? Nope, still only two, good. Monk's missive. May the best win. Seek me to the east if you wish to pursue the way of the warrior. When you find me, you will challenge me to a bout. There is no need for words. You have a knack for timing, my fellow. I found the site of a new cross. Take this. Thank you. Mikula has said as much himself. He wishes now to throw it all away. He says the act, though undoubtedly painful, will sear clean the Earth Three's wanton sin. The truth of his claim can be found at each cross, which is evidence enough to earn my belief. Hmm. I'm guessing the one furthest south is the one we're at right now. Oh no, wait, this is the this is the same map as before, just with extra ones added, I think. Well, in any case, I think we're going east to fight this warrior man. Oh, actually, first we want to get the map. And hopefully not draw the ire of the Wicker Man in the process. Hello. I 
I believe the term is bodied. And we're really close to the center of the action. Are you ready? Just getting started. Yeah, look at that. There's another- look! Get named area. Several of them. Ember of Mesmer. A remnant of Mesmer's flame, the symbol of the crusade. It continues to smolder as if crawling across the ground. Gross. Fireworms. Ooh, ouch. Ouch indeed. Mesmer Soldier Armor. Though the chess piece features a Skadu tree motif, gold has been used for its engraving, a small consolation to those forced to wage a war without grace or honor. I don't think this is the right east. This is the wrong east. I'm going this way anyway because there's a pool up ahead that looks like it could be a point of interest. Oh. Oh god, there's some kind of horrible bear here. No. I don't want to fight a bear. These things suck. Well, let's go. Mind me. I'm just a little bug. Come on now. He gives plenty of warning for that, I just choose to ignore it. Wind powers. Down you go. Ralva. Ooh. 
Pelt of Ralva the Great Red Bear, worn upon the head without modification. Enhances incantations of what is jokingly called Bear Communion. <laughs> this untreated hide, one at the head of a bloody bout, is just the thing to make a wild bear out of a warrior. Bear Communion. We got Highland attire back there as well. Highland warriors are known to be hunters of bears. To them, there is no act more glorious than the subjugation of a savage beast. Well, guess what? I subjugated. Probably get down this way. I did see in the trailer, like, using a spell that turns your head into a bear. So I don't think bear communion is necessarily a joke. I see a shack and a bridge. I also see some ruins. Let's check that out. Wormies. Oh, there's a secret Erd tree. when far beyond, far out of sight, the Erd Tree will surely give us its blessing. This is like a secret place of worship for Erd Tree people. I'll read that message. Yay! Poison swamp ahead. I don't want to. Do, I don't want to go there. Not yet, anyway. Excuse me, fellas. Morth Ruins. But I am. I abandon here the flesh of my body. Doesn't want to talk. Okay. What if I did this? What about then? Pretty good. Feeling strong, feeling competent. Don't know why this guy won't talk to me, but never mind. Dead east, right? I guess he might be over here, maybe. Oh! <laughs> I was minding my own business, guys. Okay. 
again. Guys. Reading a map. Oh god, no. You know what's worse than a crab? A lobster. Oh god, there's two of them. things. Any hidden caves? Mushroom. Going on over here. Hidden cave. Hold it. Ah, no, this is a forge, so there's, if I'm not mistaken, there's not going to be a boss here. There's just going to be a way to forge a thingy. So let's forge a thingy. Tell me what Smith script is. One of those guys just died down there. With slime. Yeah, I know. Ah, 
mistimed it and hit me right in the head. Try and guard counter more. I love the sound cue. <coughs> oh, pardon me. Wary of right, who would have guessed? Oh, he was like petting it. I feel bad now. <laughs> yeah, I deserve this. good system for these guys now. He says, missing the attack. Monster. He said I felt bad about it. Behold, down. But be wary of up. Smithing Talisman. Enhances weapon throwing attacks. Interesting. In ancient times, smithing was a divine act, and blacksmiths interpreted the script they perceived in the wrinkles of molten steel to imbue weapons with souls. Okay. Thank you for the explanation. I appreciate that game. I think using that as a lift would get me anywhere. Yeah, I should have seen that coming. Fighting two at once could be tricky.
Yep, definitely tricky. Script Cirque. Okay. I feel like I will die if I go down there. But then, where do I go? I'm lost. <laughs> Did we come from... I think this is the way... Maybe. Yeah, because that leads nowhere. I'm pretty sure I will have reached the end when there's a, uh... Little teleport that takes you back to the beginning. I guess I'll kill this guy. I don't really want to, but... What am I missing here? This doesn't actually... Oh, yeah, that is what you have to do. Huh. There you go. Sneaky. What do we got? Ancient meteoric or greatsword. Ooh. Love the sound of that. Requires 19 arcane, though. Look at that! Fashioned from an excavated shard of an arrowhead that was once a part of the old god's arsenal. A capable we piercing weapon that excels at thrusting attacks. Mm, maybe not my kind of weapon. Definitely sounds like it should be though. Oh, I do like that poke. I thought it meant like the base attack would be thrusting, but it's... Probably the roll poke as well. Yeah. Ooh, maybe. I like this. That's pretty badass. It's a bit so ledgy. White light charge. Summons white light from the crevice in the weapon's ancient meteoric core using its power for a charging attack which pierces foes. Additional input causes the light to explode. I think I might need to respec for this. That looks badass. 
Mm, maybe. Something to consider. A little reliable. There it is. Well, discovering a cool sword, that is a good place to end the stream, I think, guys. Made a lot of progress, I think. Killed a few bosses. Discovered a couple new areas. All good stuff. And uh, who knows what awaits us beyond. So I will see you all next time. Thank you for joining me. Have a good night. Bye-bye.